If every hole had a sphincter, that was gonna be really dirty. I can't see it. Look, my head's out. Hey, welcome uh, back to our stupid ranks. It's Ian Corbin. I'm Rick. You follow us on Instagram, it's the Twitter, Facebook, 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 Best ever food uh, oh, review good. show. And it's called Spicy Indian Food Challenge. Ghost pepper chutney and the spiciest street food in Delhi, India. Ghost pepper chutney? That'll mess with your sphincter. I'm not going to try it. Did you know a sphincter is just a pinching hole? <laughs> I was trying so hard not to laugh. <laughs> but you did. <gasps> So uh, we love these videos uh, that the best oh, ever yeah. food review show. Always great. Uh, does Go, uh, have you ever had a ghost pepper? <laughs> <laughs> I barely had jalapenos. Right, come on. <laughs> <laughs> I'm never going to try ghost pepper. Even a little bit? No, ever. Come on. No, it doesn't interest me in the slightest. But why? Because I would die. Here we go. <clears throat> There's almost nothing here. Simple it. Oh, no! Is it really that bad? You ever done it? It is about to be good. No, I've had the, the spiciest uh, pepper what's the in other India. spicy one. Are you ready? Uh, Let's do this. Let's remember, do this. We'll remember it later. Today on the best ever food review show, we are going on another fun food adventure, this time in Delhi, India, where we are looking for the most spiciest food <laughs> we can find. We all know that spicy food and spicy Habanero. food challenges yes. is the best way Habanero. to burn your stupid face off. <laughs> even better way to get views on YouTube. <laughs> we have some dang spicy food. I don't recommend doing double chilies. I'm dying over here. Today we're doing an all out spicy tour in Delhi. Yeah. We experience three levels of spice, ending with India's hottest chili pepper, the ghost pepper, 200 times hotter than a jalapeno. So you see, oh. the color of the chili is so dark. It is so red. so spicy. <laughs> Nope. And as terrifying as this journey will be, do we even need to do this? Because I'm honestly not even that um, hungry. Luckily, local food blogger Nikita will be by my side to show me how it's done. No, you can't cheat. Why is Indian food so spicy? We love uh, spice in our life. Why do we die when it gets spicy? That's a good point. Which food are you most excited for today? I really want to try more inshallah. Yeah, that is the spiciest chili available in India. Great. I <laughs> Don't say that. We are going to our first location and we are going to try Virchibada. is a green chili filled with seasoned and spiced mashed potatoes. It's then coated in a thick fried. batter made from chickpea flour and deep fried like a state fair corn dog. Ah. So basically it's a green chili, it's a big green chili. It's not spicy. It might look spicy to you, but it's not spicy. Now you might Bullshit. think that the heat would be coming from the green chili itself. But no, it has a sidekick. This is green chili and coriander chutney. This is tamarind chutney. It's a little sweet. And this is the spiciest chutney. It's lesson with red chili. Which is gonna actually be hotter, that green pepper or the red chutney here? This is spicy. This is red. This is pure red chili. If anything that's gonna take me down, it's gonna be this fiery red chutney. It looks like a big corn dog. I'm gonna get this nice refreshing coriander <coughs> chutney. Do you wanna try some with me? Yeah. We're gonna take a bite of our, our big okay. corn dog. It's so rich. That is some heavy food. <laughs> the pepper inside, it's like a little warm, but not mm. nothing too spicy in here. The breading on the outside is super thick. Now there's this, this, this one. This is, yes. All right. Let's... Dip it inside. Go deeper. Go deeper? Yeah. How's that? Yeah. Will that make you proud of me? Yes. Cheers, I'll break my rule. Mm. It's going to have some heat on it. I'm fine. I'm fine. <laughs> I like too. Oh, it's a, oh, oh, oh. It takes a second. Is it hot for you? I'm cool. You're, you're cool. <laughs> All right, you're in the zone. Heavy, savory, and full of spice. This was the perfect way to start the day, but we're just warming up. This is it's the combination. They come like uh, they're paired. They're it's like Bonnie and Clyde, or like well, we're like a good couple that are always together. He and Ranja. Yeah, it's like Bonnie and Clyde, or like here and Ranja. Ranja. Yeah. Okay. Next location. <laughs> 
the shower planning for Joel. Yeah. Next, we're kicking things up a notch at Two Indian with their blazing red spicy concoction. It's really the red. With head chef Ahmad, we are in the restaurant Two Indian, and he's going to talk to me about his special recipe here. What we are doing is they're making lalmans. The basic ingredients of lalmans is the red matania chili. So you see, oh. the color of the chili is so dark. It is so red. It's so spicy. Nope. <laughs> So that, that is where the dish is like ketchup, lal, right? right? Your face is gonna burn off. Lol, ha, laugh out loud, ha. Lol mas. Lol mas literally means red mutton. It's a meat oh. curry from Rajasthan. The version made here at Two Indian just happens to be spicy as heck. Do you have any tips on how I can survive this experience? Uh, no. Lal mas starts with mutton that's marinated in ginger garlic paste, mm. plenty of red matanya chili, a whole host of Indian spices, yeah. including chili powder. Finally, wow. yogurt, and the whole mixture marinates for about 45 minutes. Time to fire up the old kadai, throw in some oil and spices, including some more chilies. We add all those raw kara spices. <laughs> like food spices, yeah. cardamom, cumin, uh, bay leaf, cinnamon, big cardamom, green cardamom. We need to add onion and then we need to add ginger garlic paste again. The uh, marinated mutton. Even more chili powder and other spices are added and it's cooked on low heat until it becomes this demonic shade of red. <laughs> Adding a bit of cloves and clarified butter on top of a coal to add a bit of smokiness. Very cool. Location one was just a warm up, but now we're getting into the real thing. Yeah. <laughs> Would you try that? Yes. yes. Along with the lamas, yes. we've got some roti ah, and lassi. Roti and the lassi, and the lassi. that'll help. And I like bread. On the side here, we have the lassi. <laughs> lassi is a blend of yogurt, water, and sugar. Perfect Yum. for staving off the heat and adding lassi some balance to oh, heavier so Indian meals. We're gonna eat it with some of this bread. This is some romali roti. Romali means handkerchief, everybody. And it's the thinnest roti in all of India. Okay. Warm up? Yeah, just warm up. Just to see what we're dealing with here. Let's go for it. <sighs> okay. Ooh, it's sneaky. It's good. It actually tastes really amazing. Yeah? The flavors are outstanding. Very warm. All right, let's add a little bit more. That was just a tiny little sample and I can feel the fire in my chest traveling down you to my stomach. It after like five seconds? Oh, yeah. I felt it immediately and even more after five seconds. <laughs> <laughs> oh my God. It looks like a crime scene. <laughs> blood. I've got my super thin roti right here. I'm just gonna sop up a bunch of this sauce. I'm gonna put some yeah, meat yeah. in. Oh. Look at the the color, the shade of red. It's the shade of death. Death to my taste buds. <laughs> I'm gonna try even more. Listen, I don't like these shows where they try the spicy food and they're like, oh, I'm just gonna have a little bit. Oh, it's spicy. I'm gonna just really jump into it here. Go for it. Okay. <laughs> that is spicy, but it's pretty tolerable. The spice is adding the I flavor, don't, I don't not agree. just heat. Exactly. The heat is building right, inside yeah. you. And I died in Rajasthan. Warm coming from my <laughs> chakra region. So you don't even need lassi? No, I don't need no lassi. <laughs> Did you eat any? I am. I'm oh, eating. it's a little spicy for you. <laughs> I heard that. Do you hear that? She was doing that like. <laughs> Take a little bit. I'm okay. gonna be a match for you. Our third destination is still left. That's true. I love it. It's spicy, but it's a welcoming spice. Mm -hmm. It doesn't bust your door down. It knocks on your door. Mm -hmm. It says, "May I please come in <laughs> and, and share the good news about spice?" Thank you probably favorite. need to eat, finish all this, then I'll have you let's see. Then we're done. <laughs> 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 All that remains is going head to yeah. head with Nikita. This is what I want to see. Take on India's hottest pepper. I am with Bunho here at Nagaland <laughs> Stall number 19. And today, mm. we're going to be trying the hottest pepper in India. I'll have you know, I just ate some mutton curry and it was seasoned with Rajasthani chili pepper. Mm -hmm. It was very red. Okay. Is it going to be more hot than that? Yeah, I'm sure. <laughs> I can assure you. What is the best way to eat this? The best way is uh, in chutney. The taste comes better in chutney. A chutney is no a ground up yeah, sauce. It's, it's Today's be ghost pepper pain. chutney includes five peppers. Each is roasted, then they're ground up with some salt. None of the spiciness is wasted. Like every bit of hotness is going into the chutney. All the seeds, everything is crushed up in there. Oh, good. Some tomatoes are also roasted, skinned, and ground up along with the ghost peppers, creating a salsa from hell. He just made <laughs> here. He's gonna sample it. Just a tiny, tiny, tiny. Doesn't look like salsa. He's got. He has, he has almost nothing here. Sample it. <laughs> no. no. 
<laughs> is it really that bad? It's spicy? Oh no, what am I doing? He ate almost nothing. It looks innocent enough, but on the other side of that spoon is a pathway to pain. This genuinely seems like a bad idea. We could just you do that. We don't have to do this. We started it. A, li a little bit. I would, <laughs> just, just, I would taste a teeny bit of it. Nowhere near that much. Rice and we're ready to eat. First of all, the owner- I would have the roti with the rice. She's going to a movie theater or something. <laughs> She's sitting there ready to watch the show. Yeah. Good. So we're gonna scoop up some rice? Yeah. Yes. This is a very simple chutney and I like it because it's gonna be the full flavor of the pepper. There's five peppers inside. Can we smell it first? You what? Yeah. It's gonna burn. Okay. It singes the nostrils a bit. It's kind of like gasoline. Oh, <laughs> oh, oh my goodness. That much. Should Seriously. we try it first? Or should we just go for it? Let's just go for it. Let's just go for it. Oh I my goodness. Myself, I looked at the owner and she just went. Uh, Don't touch your eyes. Like that. A full on bite the hottest pepper in India. <laughs> Let's do this. Oh, He's God. unimpressed. Here, cheers. He's going to regret that. Okay. I can feel like there's something there's something wrong. I can feel it too. There's something wrong. Oh. Oh. <laughs> I'm like <coughs> I'm on the precipice of going down the roller coaster of spice. Oh the heat is building, really? but it's not stopping. It won't stop. Oh, do you have a tongues? <laughs> it is intense pain. I can feel it. Yeah, it's right in the back of my throat. It touched there directly. How long does it take to go away? Do you know? No, you can't cheat. What is that? Just laugh it. See. No, I won't do it. I got too much pride. <laughs> it's all in your head. You won't you die. Not? It won't kill you. In my brain, it's cooking my frontal cortex. Why do people do this? I should have heated her morning. She literally, <laughs> I took the spoon and she was like, no, no, no. Should we take another bite? Are you crying? I'm starting to feel like high, but I don't just think it's from the hyperventilating. Take another bite. Let's do it. <laughs> Guys watching, you want her to take another bite, right? I'm gonna eat another bite right do now. Do it. Do it. Do it. Dang it, we make fun food videos on this show. I'm here to entertain, and I can't feel my face anymore anyway, so it doesn't matter. Yeah. How do I look? Do I look good? <laughs> um, ma'am, how long does it take for the pain to go away? A few minutes? That's nothing. This does not compare to any spice I've ever had in my life. It feels like it's literally cooking the inside of my mouth. It feels like my throat is blistering. It's the worst pain in my life. We did. Boom. Don't try. The just said if we eat a little bit more of this, the pain will go away. That doesn't add up at all. I don't believe her. Let's get to my screen and let's jump into the conclusion that we filmed before we ate all this nonsense. Okay. <sighs> Guys, this video was made possible by One Trip Vietnam. One Trip is a company in Vietnam putting on amazing tours throughout the entire country. Right now in Saigon, Da Nang, and Hoi An, they do all kinds yeah, of tours it. from food tours. So, put him on it. Oh yeah, would never do that ever in my life. I would do it. Like there's, we went to the spiciest food we had in India was in, in Rajasthan. Rajasthan. It's easily. Uh, the spiciest food. Uh, even at the one that you guys saw at the palace that we went to, it was delicious food. Delicious Some of the food. best food we had. Really good food. But it was very spicy. There's one you didn't see because the audio and video was so terrible. We went to this famous place. That was a really cool place, actually, mm -hmm. uh, in, in, in uh, Jaipur. Uh, that was extremely really spicy hot. food. Yeah, uh, really hot. That, that we had. I remember saying to Indrani, because we walked out of there, and I said, I hope Corbin's okay. That because... That was really hot. That was uh, extremely hot for yes, me. Yes, yes. Uh, I just, I'm sorry you guys couldn't see it. The, the audio and video was just terrible. Because uh, it was all at night. Well, the most, the most heat, I have never had a ghost pepper, but I have had mm. a um, habanero. And it's, it's not, you don't measure it in heat. At that point, what you're measuring is just pain. Just pain. It, it it's a pain. That's what it I, hurts. That's what I measure most spicy things. In. Yeah, it's, yeah. It's no, pain. this is now some some spices I've had where your lips get numb and your nose is a little numb and you're dripping and your eyes are watering. That's awesome. But when you I can't disagree. taste and you're just in pain, that's what it is. <sighs> that's what it is when I eat a jalapeno, Rick. That's like <laughs> I've you've seen the. Contests where people are eating. I've thought about doing like a spice challenge. Obviously, I, it wouldn't be very good with me because no. I would be out immediately. We give you SRK's nips and yeah. you're going to be done. But uh, I thought about having a, a, quite a few people in here 
uh, and Somebody bunch of somebody's watching for the very first time. There's like, did he just say SRK's nips? There's a whole salami joke there you've missed if you haven't seen anything till now. SRK has salami nips, bro. Anyway, you were saying, I'm sorry, I didn't mean uh, that. But yeah, it's. I, I hate so what? What do you want to do? I don't know. For a there's just spice there's thing. like Indian spice challenges. Yeah, that I've seen all over YouTube, um, and so people like seeing people in pain. It's, it's, it's a true. fun thing. It's like you said, <laughs> it's it's a it's a YouTube thing. Yeah, people like watching other people eat spicy stuff so they can see them in pain. Yep, I would not be good because I would be out way before the spiciest thing came along. Uh, <laughs> How do you think Stephanie would do? She's good with spice. Yeah, pretty good. She's not like a great. She's not like, she doesn't no, love, love spice, but she's good she, with she spice. She can handle it. Yeah. Uh, as opposed to me, who cannot. Uh, I think Leland can handle spice better than you. We've given him spice. And, um, cause she grows poblano peppers uh -huh. back here. Um, and she made a pasta with it and it was delicious pasta, but I couldn't handle it. Cause it, was it got really spicy. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I could only have a couple bites. Leland, he got a bite and he was like, <coughs> and he just kept eating. Rock and roll. <laughs> and so. Good man. It's, it's happened a couple times. And I was like, I, cause. I don't mind, I, I hate not being able to eat certain things. Like, I don't like that. I don't like certain food. Right. I want to like everything. I right. I, like, it makes no sense to me when people are like, oh, I hate that. I hate, I don't like that. I don't like fish. Because I'm like, it just oh, takes away, shame. like, a bunch of stuff that you can eat. That's your experience, yeah. But obviously I hate that I can't eat because people seem to love spice. And I just, I, I can't do it. It's painful. So spicy fish would be really, really bad for you. I mean, they probably have a lot in that Mingal, right? Fish Lots product. of it. Yeah. <laughs> well, let us know what other food videos we should react to. And uh, it's Don't hard rub to, your eyes. It's hard to do food videos now because obviously we've had most of the Indian food, especially in India. In India. Yeah. And so it's hard. Uh, as opposed to, yeah, like, unless you make it, which I, I haven't done well on my channel. Which <laughs> <for> my <laughs> <laughs> Josh!